Right, we have got what is known as a sound velocity profiler. Hayes, tell us what this does and why it is such an important piece of kit when you're doing a seabed survey. So we use sound to measure the depth and it take, we measure the amount of time it takes to come from the sounder to the seabed and to know how fast it's travelling is, is really important. So this measures the speed of sound through the water column, not just at the surface but all the way down to the bottom. Um, and the sound velocity can change depending on where you are, the time of the tide, um, the temperature. Salinity. Salinity, salt. So if we're going past a, a river mouth it'll change dramatically. So we'd have to do them about every three hours and, and then immediately load them into our computer to make sure that we're correctly getting the water depth. Right, and so you know we talked with Kate before about the sounder and how it's sending out all those sound beams bouncing off and, and it's really key that you know of course how fast those are travelling. That's, yep. that's interesting. So there's also another interesting bit of kit we're going to have a look at just over here. Well this is a funny looking thing, it's like a big claw, you call it a, call it a grab. A grab sampler. Yeah, so let's have a look at this. Tell us all about it. So it's just a big claw that we lower down to the seabed to pull back uh, samples of whatever's down there and we do that primarily to figure out what safe anchorage is or if it's rock or a muddy seabed for information for the chart or sometimes we do it for scientific reasonings when we can preserve the samples and bring it back to whoever wants it to figure out what's down there and what it's composed of. Cool, just so see how it opens and... Down there, so it pops down, slams shut and we pull it back up and dump it in the bucket. So there's actually one more one really more. cool thing just here, so can have a look. <laughs> And here we have an ROV, remotely operated vehicle. Chuck that on your Christmas wish list. Hayes, this is an awesome looking piece of kit. What do you use this for? So we use this for it to go and inspect things on the seabed that we might not want to disturb or grab. Yeah. So if we're in a marine reserve or other environment where we just want to observe fish or what coral or reefs are made up of, we go zoom down with this. and run some lines and collect some footage for scientists or other people. So it's like a submarine with a camera? Yep. And tethered, so it's got a line yep. sending your data back. Recording the video and um, talking to our remote control. So we can Right, so you're, you're controlling it yep. with that, you've got your cell phone there. Brilliant! Yeah. Such a nice little piece of kit. Yeah.